I wonder if this video works. We'll see. Um, or if I'm sideways. But, um, I'm gonna do my hair reveal in a minute. But let me vlog what happened the last few days. Um, so, I'm like looking at the center of the screen. But, camera right there so but yeah um basically yesterday was the concert i came home waited for my mom to come home because she brought groceries but she also got off work a little bit late so i was a little bit late to my dress rehearsal or not dress rehearsal um my call time uh, but I think it's okay because it was only like six minutes, but I still am disappointed in myself. Anyways, um, then we warmed up, then we hung out until the concert started. And then, uh, um, our intermediate choir performed first, then we performed, then we both performed, then the, like, um wind ensemble performed then the jazz band performed and then what was the last one i forgot what it was called uh, i'm so sorry i forgot what the last one was called but another band performed it was like almost there already so yeah but i forgot what it was called so i'm sorry um then they had like free free with donation cookies and drinks because they're provided by the people who help out the art and music program so yeah that was pretty cool and then i went home my mom really wanted to go home because it was late so yeah and then Today, I got up, we had, we celebrated Mother's Day today because my mom works tomorrow, and we had French toast because that's her favorite breakfast, and we had strawberries with it, and then we went and got a haircut, so let me do a hair reveal, I apologize if it's like sticking up because I did just take a shower a little bit ago, and also it's been under this hoodie for like an hour. Um, because I love this hoodie, so I decided to put it on, so, yeah. We'll see. There's a hair reveal for me, too, because it's probably sticking up. Oh my gosh. Wow. I'll, I'll show you guys the back. I don't even know what the back looks like, so. Let me turn around. Whoa. I'll show you my controller. Whoopsie. Let me go into the game real quick. Anyways, that is what my hair looks like. It's so weird adjusting to it. It looks a little messy right now. It's okay. But Lucas almost knocked the thing over. Anyways, that's about it that I wanted to vlog today. But I guess you could, I'm going to vlog me playing Adopt Me for a little bit because I want the video to be at least like 10 minutes long because. I think that's a good length, I feel like. I don't know. I just want to, like, document. I do watch my vlogs back because, like, I want to see how I've changed. Lucas, can you not? Please. Lucas. He is messing with my stuff and walking all over the bed. So sorry about that. You cannot see because it is way too bright on my screen, but I'm going to be a parent for now. I think I only need one more day and then I get a Pomeranian. You can't even see that, but anyway. <laughs> 
Hold on, let me. Okay, is that better, guys? I don't know, it's still kind of bright, but I'm trying. Also, sorry for it moving. It's on my bed, but yeah. I have now logged in. Here's my money tree that I wasted money on because it only gives me $8. Money trees are not worth it, pretty much. They cost way too much, and they don't even give you that much at a time. <laughs> Anyways, where's my pet that I was aging up, yo? Oh, there he is. I already did that one. Okay, I'm gonna jump this one. I'm trying to get a neon brachiosaurus because I got like a whole bunch from that event. So, yeah. But let me do a house tour real quick. This is my apartment house that I spent like days saving up for and a lot of time decorating. I probably got this around like three years ago. So, yeah. Um, this is my house tour, so this is the entrance, there's a beautiful blue carpet, because blue is a theme, look at the blue walls, the waves, okay, this is right here, the musical corner, where you can put on some music on our jukebox, or you can play the piano, or sing, while you're playing the piano, um, also, fun fact, pets, if they want to go to the playground, they can actually use the piano, and it'll get rid of that, so you don't have to go to the playground. Here is where you put all the bad kids. No, I'm just kidding. But there's like three cribs here because there's a whole bunch of pet beds over there. And so I thought it would only be fair to have some cribs for the babies. Even though it doesn't matter what they sleep in. But, you know. There's just a place you can put your babies. And here is the little take care area. We have bathtubs and food bowls and beds. And we have a little crib right here with some toys. And then we have the same thing over here. So, yeah. Um, and this is the little library. The cozy little library where you can sit by the fire and read. We have some beautiful books. And, of course, we have the money tree, which is, like, spitting money into the library, unfortunately. But, you know, that's where I put it. I don't know. And then over here is just a little movie room where you can chillax and watch a movie if you want to. Um, and then there's just a random couch here if you want to sit down, I guess. Um, and there's also a couch right here as well. And then I'm going to jump up here because th there's like a little, on top of these little nooks, there's a little seating area with some C-shaped couches where you can just sit and talk with your friends, I guess. And then we have a little support group. A little GSA, if you will, I guess. So, yeah, you can just talk about stuff. I just want to make that fun, Reese. Okay. Um, we're going to go down first because it's, like, way more fun. Sorry. I had to clear my throat. Okay, so. These little things are just stalls. They have a toilet in them. You can't really see, but there's a toilet. Um, because I thought it'd be, like, a good idea, you know, to have some stalls, I guess. You don't really need to use the bathroom and adopt me, but just to be realistic, I guess. And then this big sign says what well, all is included in this basement area. So there is a pool, a catwalk, a buffet, a daycare, a movie theater, and a mini club. So you can use any of that. Right here is just another take care station if you would like to use it. And then over here is the daycare area. We have a ball pit and bouncy house for the kids and some toys and a little unicorn lamp. And then over here is the nook where we have some water you can grab. And then the little kids and pets can go under here. They can play. They can read books. They can just lay down on these pillows. And then the pets can also eat and drink. And we also have like a little penguin. Some more books and even a bathtub if they want to have a little bubble bath. And then over here is the buffet area. We have coffee, all the teas. We have a donut lamp. We have a donut making station and a pizza making station and some cups for your coffee. Over here is a little lounge area so you can lounge by the pool. This is the pool. It's very big. 
There's some sand castle seats. It's also where the judges sit for the catwalk. This is the catwalk over here. Um, yeah, it's very tropical looking. Then we have the catwalk where you can say like, oh, this is my outfit, blah, 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 blah. And there's little lights and stuff. And then there's stars right here to celebrate. And you can dress up here. Or you can, and you can sit down to like put on your shoes or something. And you can walk down the catwalk, you know, say, this is my outfit. Walk again. The judges judge you, you know. <laughs> and then in the pool, there is a place for time out. If you're very, um, bad, you can be in there, I guess. I don't know. I didn't hate it, guys. Anyways, here's a place for the adults to sleep if they would like to. There's also lots of books so they can just chill if they need time away from the kids. And then over here is the shower room because, you know, you, you've been in the pool. You need to wash off. And then over here, there's a little diving board, but it also works as like a little platform to walk over here. This is where the movie theater is. Let me turn this off because it's really bright. So this is the movie theater. There's a whole bunch of seats to watch the TV. And then there's also a place to sit for the kids. And they can also just like, this is where the, if they fall asleep during the movie, you could just put them over here. And then if they also want to slide down the side, they can. And then up these steps, you jump over this wall. And this is the little mini club. There's a tiny dance floor where you can dance. And then you can also dance right here, technically. And then there's where the DJ goes, right here. So yeah, that is the basement. Um, I fell in the pool. Oopsies. Anyways, we're going to go upstairs now. All the way up to the first room right here this is themed after cuddles well actually it was made for one of my other friends but um they don't i don't really play with them anymore so i just made it for cuddles i had a lot of friends on roblox i'd play like bloxburg with when i could like chat and i made them rooms in here but i decided to theme them after my friends that i've had for a long time instead so this is cuddles apartment we have like a little tree and a little place to put his stuff well imagine there's a lock and then he can sit there if he wants or people who are waiting for him and there's a rug and this whole place is like themed royal and fancy and cuddles really likes like medieval games i guess so that's why i did that also it's kind of already themed kind of like that so well actually i think it's themed more like cutesy i don't know but this is his living room. It's very nice, very whimsical, I guess. Very fancy. And then there's a sitting he area here and a piano. And then in here is like his little pets room. So it says, welcome pets. And then there's like some places for them to sleep, eat. You know, the caregiver can sit. There's more places. They even have their own TV. And then there's a little royal place for the best pet, I guess. And then over here is where the kids can play. There's a little bounce castle because, you know, castle. And I just put the ball pit for fun, you know. Um, there's a little oven. Box of books. Somewhere you can sit. That's the balcony exit. And then here's where you make your pizza. I made every apartment either have a pizza or donut making place. Then we have a dining table with some chairs. Even a pet high chair and a human high chair. And then we have the little shelf for all your stuff for the kitchen. We have bottles and a grate and glasses and book cookbooks. And here's the kitchen. There's even water in the fridge. And here's the stove and stuff, microwave stuff. And here's a little desk he can do his work if he wants. And then there's little plants right here. So that is that. And then let's go into the bedroom. This is going to be a way longer video than I thought it was going to be. Sorry, I am pouring my house. Anyways, here is my, I mean, not my, Cuddles' bedroom. We have bookcase. And then right here is, like, your get ready station. You can even make potions. I don't know what these potions do. Hyper speed. Okay. You can sit down, get dressed. There's, you know, another bookcase. This little divider. You can sit here. Here's the royal crib that you can put the baby in. And here's the royal double bed he can use. You can watch some TV. And here's some candles right there and stuff. So this is his beautiful 
bedroom and then this is his bathroom of course it's very stylish you can get your hair done there's double tubs and then of course a baby toilet seat too so that is cuddles's house um now we're gonna go upstairs there's a little green screen where you can take pictures or something with your friends or whatever and then right here is just a little sitting area you can just sit chill there's another sitting area for Quinn and Caleb's apartment because they're both my friends that, like, I play with an equal amount, I guess, so that's why. Um, but yeah, we just sit here. You can just sit here and wait for them. And inside is just some books on the shelves. This, this apartment actually has always just been, like, the empty apartment that nobody claimed, so. But I themed it modern slash deluxe, so. Yep, this is the entrance though. There's a nice place. You can even play piano if you want. There's a jukebox. It's very music inspired too as well, I think. And then right here is just like a little couch. There's a little work area. And then over here is the living room with a C-shaped couch watch TV. There's actually like a table on top of a table, I'm pretty sure. And then this corner is just the baby's toys or whatever. And then over here is like a stage where you can sing. Like that's kind of fun. And then right here is um, the donut making station and dining table. So you can whip up some breakfast and have it right here. And then over here there's just a random pet bed. I didn't really know what to put here. So yeah. And also I had originally made a lot of these apartments for like my friends who are girls. But now... My friends I made them for our guys. So I used to have like makeup areas, but I deleted them. This used to be like a makeup area where you could do your makeup and there's like a separate room, but I deleted it because I don't think Quinn or Caleb do their makeup, so but yeah. And here's a little area for your pet to sit while you make some breakfast. And there's even like a little place for your kid to sit maybe. Here's the beautiful shelf, of course, with all of your stuff for the kitchen. There's even a rolling pin. And here's where your pet can drink and eat if it would like to. And a fire extinguisher, of course. This is the kitchen. There's a little bar to sit at. Like a like a counter, kind of. So I used a table, but, you know. And this is the beautiful place. I used, like, cabinets for... I mean, counters for cabinets, maybe? Or maybe they are cabinets i don't know but the knives are way up there and turn the wrong way so that your kids don't get them and there's coffee you know water in the fridge microwave stuff like that so yeah that is um the beautiful kitchen oops okay so now we're moving on to the bedroom someone has been in this apartment because the doors are open and usually i leave the doors closed even if i go through them but some people like to visit my apartment. I don't really care because, like, it has a little stuff to take care of your pets. And I usually put it right by the school, so. Anyways, this is your pet's food bowl. Okay. This is a little place to watch TV in your room if you would like to. And then this is a workstation, as it says. There's, like, a laptop and then also a PC, so depending on what you need to do. It's very fancy, though. So we have a little, um bunny bed right here and then of course then the single bed we have a safe right there a dog lamp and we have a lot of books to read to the kids on the dresser and you can sit here and read the baby to sleep so that is that um and then this is the bathroom pretty excuse me pretty average to be honest don't throw the baby in the tub please but yeah that is the that is this apartment this apartment is modern deluxe themed so yeah Okay, up to Banjo's apartment. Basically for these apartments, so I just recolored them, so, yeah. But here's where you can sit outside, you know, another dog lamp. You can just chill. This is Banjo's apartment. His favorite color is orange, so I made it orange. So, yeah, right here is you can just get water or coffee if you want as soon as you come in. Pretty iconic. We have our little um, entrance with a whole bunch of stuff up there. It's nice. Right here is the little kitchen. There's, it's a very tight kitchen, but it's very cute. Oh yeah, this theme is like cute and cheap themed. So it's just stuff from those two themes and dot me. We have like our little 
a little of clutter and then we have our shelf right here let me close this door but yeah this is our shelf it has some flowers and candles and stuff on it of course too and his little high chair and this is a dining table kind of with a unicorn so that's where they can all sit there's a piano right here with a um apple so this is the pizza making station we can make some pizza and there's also tea yes so you can make tea as well some crates a little arch around the balcony door and then this is like the for real dining table i guess so it has ketchup and mustard as well and they have little heart chairs very cute there's a giant ball pit for the living room and this is the living room space there's a pc and laptop as well and a little place for your pet to sleep if they want plus it looks like a chair this is the couch and the TV and there's a book right here. Another shelf with a whole bunch of living room stuff. And another little reading nook area and a boom box right here as well. So that's pretty cool. Okay, let's go to the... Oh yeah, I forgot about this room. Boom, boom. Wait, did this... I don't think the other one ha had this room. Anyways, there's two donut... Um, it's like, where did my pet go? Anyways, this is the donut little crib bed things for pets, I think. There's a double tub if you would like. It says, welcome pets. There's food bowls. You can dress up. It's just like a little closet area where your pets can use it. And, you know, there's a little dog house and toys and stuff. So, yeah, that is that room. And then in here's the bedroom. We have a little reading area. We have a bounce house for the kid and the kid's crib and stuff. Here is the bed. You can also have your pet sleep. I think, or no, this is just a table. I usually like move the book onto it or something. But yeah, this book. But this is like your little work area, but it's also a dresser. And then this is like where you can watch TV in your room if you would like to as well. And here's the bathroom, it's very basic. There is a bookshelf though in here as well. So that is the bathroom. I don't know where my pet keeps disappearing to. I was like following me, but also disappearing. Anyways, here's a little another photo shoot area with smoke. And then here's a dumbbell that you can pick up. I don't know. Anyways, this is another seating area, it's donut themed. And this is Sukasonic's apartment, aka my brother, and it's pirate themed, so there's little pirate seats, but it is pirate and vintage themed, technically. It also is whatever this theme is, like the pet update thing, I don't know what it's called, but anyway. Bro, I already told you to go to sleep and stuff. Okay, anyways. This is the entrance. I love this entrance. It is so aesthetic to me. There's a treasure chest, there's crates, scrolls, stuff like that an arrow and stuff it says welcome aboard i love this apartment this apartment i finally finished the only apartment that i didn't finish is the last one so this is a little desk you can work at i don't really know what to put here to be honest so any recommendations i love this tree as well as oh i did not realize it was intersecting real quick but anyways you can feed and give your pet a drink as well here this is the kitchen it is massive there's a little shelf where you can put some stuff. It's kind of empty, but it's okay. It has cabinets too, of course. And here's a little vibes. There's some candles and scrolls up here. Bread, pizza making, oven. There's a chair right here you can sit at. Um, this is his beautiful TV. It's very big. There's a little seating here and seating here. And a telescope. You can look outside, I guess. And then over here is the dining area. There's pumpkins over here because... Bleh. They're killing me about the sale. Anyways, there's pumpkins because my brother loves pumpkins. So here's there's that. And then this is his room. There's a little gaming area because he loves to game. There's toys for his kid. Um, There's a pet bed right there. Go to sleep. Anyways, there's a bunny bed. He loves bunnies as well, so he also has a bunny bed himself. And then he can just sit here as well, and here's his kid's bed. This room's also kind of empty, because I ran out of things to put in here, to be honest. So, I'll figure it out eventually, anyways. 
Anyways, this is the bathroom. It's rubber ducky themed, kinda. So there's that, and it's pretty simple. So yeah, that's about it for that. Anyways, let's go to the last um thing. The last room. Here's another sitting area. And then here's another sitting area outside my room. Um, there's a TV too. Um, so this is my room. It's kind of empty, especially the living room, but I did do some work on it recently. This is the piano and it has a little flat pride flag. This is like a little reading area. This is my living room. I love it so far. It has these couches and then this is our coffee table with some books and a mermaid TV because I love the little fish tank thing. And then I put this little egg chair thing because I like that. And then so far, this is my dining room. It's very like kind of basic, but it's okay. And then this is my kitchen. So far, it's kind of bare, but it isn't finished. And then all the rooms I did finish in here. I just didn't finish this main room. So this is the kids room. It has crib, some places to sit. It has a place for the um pets to be at. It has a TV, it has books, toys, and then this is like the kids area to sleep. A kid or a pet could sleep here. And then a little sitting area as well, especially since they might be too short, so they can just jump if they want to not climb, I don't know. Um, let's do my room first, I guess. This is supposed to be my room. It's purple just because I thought they went with the vibe. Like, I tried doing red, but it didn't fit the vibe, so yeah. But this is my little workstation. There's, like, all my stuff, my books, my microphone. This is the, my TV and also a pet bed right here and a couch too and a mini fridge and then here's a little pet place for the pet to eat and also the coffee table thing with a penguin lamp and then here's my bed i think this is also a tv but i'm not sure and then there's my dresser another dresser another dresser pride flag stuff like that and this is my bathroom there's a nice little shower here um clothes hanging up toilet sink area there's this little bathtub that's so cute um okay that is my room next is the guest room which is like mint themed i love the color mint it's so cool anyways it might be a bit much in here but anyways this is the pet bed little tv area there's no like super close couch but you can sit over here if you want there's another like there's a bunny bed some plants um here's the bed books stuff like that um there's a little like lamp thing the pet could eat um toys this is the bathroom there's double showers some little locker things and this um rose petal tub place to hang your clothes sink and then there's a separate room for the toilet because obviously they're guests so i don't know if they would feel comfortable like you never know so yeah, that is my apartment building tour, guys. I'm sorry it took way longer than I thought it was going to take, but that's it. That is my Adopt Me house tour. I have a couple other houses, but this one is the one I've been working on for like years. So it was not easy to decorate. It didn't take one minute. It took a while, so yeah. And I'm still not completely done with it, but I'm getting pretty close. And then I'll probably buy, like, the second most expensive house or something. But, yeah. Things are I can't. Wow. So, yeah, guys. Thank you for watching. Have a good day, afternoon, night. And I hope you enjoyed this video and this vlog. Bye.